we just crossed the line that we cannot uncross anymore. Anthropic has confirmed that Chinese hackers use Claude to autonomously hack into corporations and government agencies. Now, the scary part is that AI did 80 to 90% of the hacking work. This changes everything. What's up, everyone? So Anthropic just dropped this bombshell report about the first documented AI orchestrated cyber attack. And honestly, my first thought was, oh, shoot, are we having a Terminator moment right now? You see, this isn't theoretical anymore. This happened in September where real companies got hacked, real data got stolen, and the hackers, well, they basically just supervised while Claude did the work. Now, let me show you exactly what Anthropic actually reported. In mid-September 2025, we detected suspicious activity that later investigation determined to be a highly sophisticated espionage campaign. This happened only a couple months ago, two months ago. They just told us yesterday. No one knew this was happening. The attackers use AI's agentic capabilities to an unprecedented degree, using AI not just as an advisor, but to execute the cyber attacks themselves. AI was used to execute, not to help them, not to give them advice, but AI is the hacker now. This is insane. And then here it says overall, the threat actor was able to use AI to perform 80 to 90% of the campaign with human intervention required only sporadically, perhaps like four to six critical decision points per hacking campaign. Guys, four to six decisions. That's all the humans made. Everything else from reconnaissance, writing exploits, stealing data, it was all clawed. And what's even more scary is that it went after 30 organizations, including large companies, financial institutions, chemical manufacturing companies, and government agencies. And guess what? It succeeded in a small number of cases. Real breaches. Real damage. Now, let's check out the speed and how fast this actually happened. Now, at the peak of its attack, the AI made thousands of requests often multiple per second, and an attack speed that would have been, for human hackers, simply impossible to match. <laughs> Check this out. A human clicks maybe once per second. This thing, thousands of operations. Just think about it. While you just blinked right now, it could have already compromised your entire network. Now, they also shared how they pulled it off. It says, they broke down their attacks into small, seemingly innocent tasks that Claude would execute without being provided the full context of their malicious purpose. Then, they also told Claude that it was an employee of a legitimate cybersecurity firm and was being used in defensive testing. <laughs> so, these people social engineered the AI. And here's the genius part. It's like if I asked you to buy some fertilizer for my garden, Totally normal, right? Then I need pipes for plumbing. Also normal. Then I need some electronics for a hobby. All innocent by themselves, but put them together and yeah. <laughs> you see where this is going, right? So that's what they did to Claude. Each tiny task looked like legitimate security work. Now this is the scary part. Claude wasn't even perfect. Remember, AI has only been out for like two years right now. Claude didn't always work perfectly. It occasionally hallucinated credentials or claimed to have extracted secret information that was in fact publicly available. So it was literally making the stuff up and it was still able to break and hack into a government agency. Imagine when it stops hallucinating. Imagine when AI models get better. <sighs> so here's Anthropic's own assessment. The barriers to performing sophisticated cyber attacks have dropped substantially, and we predict that they'll continue to do so. With the correct setup, threat actors can now use agentic AI systems for extended periods to do the work of entire teams of experienced hackers. Entire teams. One person with an API key now equals a state-sponsored hacking unit. Think about this. ChatGPT, right? Ch ChatGPT came out two years ago. Two years ago. 
We went from, wow, AI writes poems or AI can write my emails or blogs for me to now AI can autonomously hack governments. And it's only been two years since ChatGPT came out publicly. What happens in five years when AI doesn't hallucinate? When it's 100 times faster? When GPT-7 or Claude 5 can maintain perfect context for days? We are honestly in an AI arms race right now. It's, it's pretty scary because like Elon Musk pretty much predicted that this could happen. And now we're seeing it. Now, one thing to point out, which is really interesting and important, is that Anthropic literally used Claude to detect this Claude attack. So now we're in a world where it's AI versus AI. If you're defending with humans against AI attackers, guess what? You've already lost. What works for Chinese espionage today becomes ransomware tomorrow. Like criminal groups are taking notes right now, I'm pretty sure. And some teenagers are going to figure this out too. So what do we do? We are living in a brand new world. This is the moment where the future arrives and it's not what we expected. We thought AI would take our jobs or become sentient. But the real first impact, it becomes the ultimate hacking tool. We're living through a fundamental shift right now, and most people don't even realize it yet, but they will, but when they do, it might be too late.